After a couple of cool days, well, I told you the warm front was coming. This morning's lows were in the low to mid 60s compared to the upper 40s to lower 50s the past couple of mornings. Plenty of sunshine out there, but we are starting to see a few clouds at the one o'clock hour begin to develop and those some of those will continue to develop into showers and some thunderstorms. It'll be very isolated dew points now in the lower 70s. It's humid. It's July 79 is the temperature in Port Washington with that humidity and that instability. Nothing going on as of one o'clock, but as the afternoon wears on, we are going to see some scattered showers and some thunderstorms. We're under a slight risk for severe weather, not for today, but for tomorrow for two events, the morning and then again late afternoon into the evening. The morning one. Well, first of all, let's talk about this evening. We're going to see a few spotty showers around with the southwest wind at 10 to 15. Not everyone's going to see the rain. Don't cancel any outdoor plans. It'll be very brief if you see it. Then the first concern is this line coming through the state overnight tonight and should be here around six, seven o'clock in the morning. Possibility of some damaging winds, large hail and a lot of rain, but it's moving fast. So the rain totals won't be all that impressive. Then we'll clear out hot, humid, and that fires off more storms late afternoon into the early evening hours for tomorrow. And that'll quickly move out of here and then we'll see a warm, humid night. Temperatures right now are almost 20 degrees warmer than they were this time yesterday and the day before. We are talking 88 degrees. We might hit 90 today. It's already 88 at 1 o'clock, 82 in West Bend and 86 in Whitewater. It is warm out there, even at the lakefront. Temperatures upper 70s to lower 80s. The humidity on the rise as well. The dew points have moved back in. Remember, we were showing you 40s and lower 50s a couple of days ago, but the 70s were just to our south where that southerly wind has brought those back in. Not just for today, tonight, tomorrow, tomorrow night into early on Sunday. We do get a break from it on Sunday afternoon. A cold front's going to come through and bring in some drier air. Very comfortable for Monday and into Tuesday as well. The Goddard gauge today giving it an eight. Partly cloudy, hazy and humid, highs near 90, and a scattered thunderstorm. An 8 this time of the year is good. If you're heading up to Green Bay for the Favre Hall of Fame induction, it is going to be hot, humid, and oh yeah, by the way, as you're sitting in the stadium sweating, you're going to have an increasing chance of thunderstorms. Hopefully it misses Lambeau, but there's a pretty good bet that there will be thunderstorms around the area. Highs tomorrow, pretty safe bet that it is going to be 90 degrees. If we don't hit it today, we'll do it tomorrow. We haven't hit 90 in Milwaukee since, since September 10th of 2013, almost two years ago. So you wanted a summer weekend, you got one. 84 degrees on Sunday with some morning thunderstorms and then clearing out in the afternoon, becoming less humid. And then next week is gorgeous sunshine, a few showers on Tuesday, highs near 80 degrees and more importantly, lower humidity. Stay cool, everyone, and have a great weekend.